guys welcome to my channel so today is Wednesday I had to think about it for a minute um if you're new to my channel I usually put a video out on Tuesdays or Wednesdays to show you deals at Dollar General you can do during the week and any penny finds that I might find along the way so I did find some penny finds I did do some deals so first let's get to the penny finds yeah, all right now if you're a penny shopper, so much stuff penny this week. There's like back to school stuff, winter and fall hardware, blue dot, gray dot. There's just so much stuff. So if you're like, I never find pennies, this would be a good time to go because there's just so much stuff that a lot of the times they don't get to pull it all. I went today, which is a day after penny shopping, and I went to a store in a bigger city and they have more penny shoppers and I still found stuff. The first thing I found were these Paper Mate pens. They're Fair Flare Felt Tip Ink Joy Gel. And it's the four plus two. I did not find these in a clearance section. I didn't find them even in the stationary section. I found them in like with some clothes stuffed on the top. So look high, look low, look where you don't think things are gonna be because you never know who's gonna pick something up in the store and just set it down. Then I found this Blue Dog necklace. It is a best friend. They're like kids stuff, you know, kids necklaces. So I'll probably just throw that in my yard sale. And this is what um, the gray dot right here. I'll show you if you're new to penny shopping. Blue dot. Then we have some gray dot. This is a sleeping mask, I think. Eye mask for like a little kid. I guess if you could wear it if you're an adult, if you want to. Um, more necklaces. They're BFF necklaces. I remember when these were cool when I was a kid. They didn't look like this, but they had the BFF necklaces. They're just two, like, little rainbows. And then more of the heart ones I just showed you. I found quite a few of these stuffed in a box with, um, the other accessories. So, they're under some flip-flops. So really, you just got to look around. It's kind of like a little scavenger hunt. Those are normally $3. And I found one other thing. This I did find actually in clearance. It's just a little unicorn pen with one of those pop dots. All these kids like to pop the stuff. And that's what that looks like. There is just so much. Just go digging and you'll probably find something. I wasn't really looking that much because I don't want a bunch of stuff like that. I'll throw it in a yard sale, like, but these I'll use. Um, but I don't need a bunch of junk laying around my house. So this week when I'm couponing, like I've been trying to do every week, unless it's free or gives me overage, I'm not getting it. And it's got to be something I'll use. Now, the first thing I got, everybody knows, if you watch me, this razor. Since you guys told me about this razor, I am hooked. Now, let me get my receipt. The price, the price went up a little. I think they used to be almost $8. And now they are ringing up at $8.25 at this store. Now we have a $4 digital coupon for this. Um, these are all digital coupons from your Dollar General app. I'm not using any paper coupons. So $4 off on this. It is a great razor. You don't even need shaving cream. I did get some of the CoverGirl products because it gives you, I'll show, by the end, you'll know why I got them. But the eyeliner, the mascara, I can't even talk today. <laughs> All right, let me look. This is $5 and we have $4 off. Now, say you're doing a five off of 25 on Saturday, you need five more dollars for your transaction. This would be great to get because you have such a high value coupon that oh, it brings it down to like a dollar once you get it. Then I got, I know I got another, my car is a mess. The CoverGirl Clean Pressed Powder looks like this. Now I think it also works the coupon on like foundation, anything for your face, it's a CoverGirl face coupon. This was $6.75 and I got $4 off on this also. There's two separate CoverGirl coupons. Then I got this big guy. This is the Old Spice Night Panther Body Wash. 
and it is the 30 ounce. Now this is a little more pricey. Um, it was, let me check, $9.35. Now, there's a $3 off coupon and a $2 off coupon. Unfortunately, I had them both clipped, so I only got $2 off. If you do um, this deal, try to have just that $3 one. I think some of you guys said if you do, I want to say if you do self-checkout, it will take off the higher value. I don't have self-checkout at my stores, so I wouldn't know. So, oh, one more thing. The Scott, I'm trying to get toilet paper or paper towels every time I go. The Scott Comfort Plus is 360 and we have a dollar off. This is just, what is this, the six roll? All right, so now this is with my bag fee of five cents because they charge me five cents because I always forget to bring a bag and they're right in my car. And with the pennies, it came to $18.09 before tax. But we're not, that's not the end of it. If you go on Ibotta, you're going to get $3 off on, um, $3 back for the Old Spice body wash on this big size. There's a bunch of Old Spice um, rebates on Ibotta right now, a lot for deodorant and a lot for body washes, but it's scent specific. And I think it was for like 24 ounce and the the store only had like the 16 ounce. Make sure you're scanning when you're in the store before you buy it just to make sure it's going to give you your rebate back. Also, always make sure you're scanning in your app to make sure you have your coupons clipped and they're going to attach and make sure you have it set to the right store. Now, this was nine. What did I say? Nine something. Plus, we had $3 off. Plus, Ibotta gave us $3 back. So that brings it down to three something for this, which is a good deal. It's a big body wash. Everything's just so damn expensive now. Okay, then I went over to Shopmium, the app where you get money back. Just a disclaimer, if you're gonna do rebates on Shopmium, don't do them on coupons.com because they're, I guess they're from like the same part, like the same place, and they'll probably catch on you're using both. Just a disclaimer, I know some of us do that. And I'd hate for you to get your account taken away just because you use both. So try not to use both. Now, Shopmium gave me back a dollar for the toilet paper. They gave me back four dollars for the Chic. They gave me back four dollars for the CoverGirl, and then four dollars for this CoverGirl. So four, eight, twelve, thirteen dollars back. Plus $3 back on Ibotta is $14.50. What did I say? Oh my gosh. $4.8.12.13.14.15.16. dollars 16. $16 back on our rebate apps. And it only costs $18.09. And I some pennies. So about $2 for all this. That's a good deal. Now, don't forget to scan it on Fetch. I got 35 points back for the Scott, and there's a Scott bonus going on till the end of the month if you buy a lot of Scott products. Um, yep, yeah, so that's about it, guys. That's my deal this week. I'm sorry. I try to get these up Tuesday, but work has just been so damn busy that I haven't had a chance, and I'm just too damn tired when I get out of work. So make sure you're scanning on Fetch, doing Ibotta, Shop me, um, maximize what you can get back, especially right now where everything's so expensive. If you need Fetch or Ibotta, I'll put my referral codes in the description box below. And thank you to the few people that use my codes during this week um, to get the apps. So I do appreciate that. What else? I have um, a Shein video that's going to come out in a week or two. I'm waiting to get my products from them. I think it comes out like the first week of June, like June 5th or something. I'm allowed to post it. They send me an email. I've never ordered from them. I've watched hauls from them, but we'll see. We'll see what kind of products they send me. See if I like them better than Timu. And I do thank you guys for watching like the Timu hauls and stuff I do. It helps me out. I ran, oh, I'll show you this. I ran over to TJ Maxx and the Dollar Tree. I usually share with you guys if I find some stuff at Dollar Tree or something I like. I did not find anything there I like this week. I did find these over at TJ Maxx. It's the Medjool Dates. I watched a video this lady did 
And she takes these, and I swear to God, it is so good. I've been back on Weight Watchers the last couple weeks, so I'm trying to be good. You take these, and you, like, cut them open, and you put a pecan in there, and, like, a half table, um, a half a teaspoon of peanut butter, and you close it back up, and then you roll it around in some melted sugar-free chocolate chips, and you freeze it. You guys... It tastes like a Snickers bar. They're so good. I'm addicted. And when I saw these and they're only $5.99, I was like, yes, let's go. So I'll be making some of those later today. They're so yummy. If you like Snickery kind of stuff and on like in a healthier way, you've got to try it. All right. Any questions, comments, leave them below and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.